Welcome back again to Evolution Snowboarding. This time we're going to the Creatures Inn, and this time we're going to be grinding some dinosaur bones. Oh yeah. Yeah, and with us we got Jamie the D. Wait, shit. We're, we're, we're riding dinosaur bones? That sounds wrong. No, we're going to grind the bones. That sounds worse. No, what? we're not going to grind their bones. We're going to grind... Grind oh, right, we're going to grind bones. on the bones. Right, right. yeah, sorry. We're not going to bump and grind <laughs> on their bones. We're not going to bump and grind with their bones. Although, to be fair, that would probably improve this game. Uh, I don't know. I mean, depending on the bones we're talking about. Man, so look at this. Look at this character customization. Look uh, at me. I know, look man. He's got, he's got so much attitude. Putting yeah. on a new shirt and my attack goes up. I wish that happened in real life. I put on my "Don't fuck with me" shirt and I just get twenty aggression. Wow. Yeah. That'd be pretty awesome, actually. <laughs> yeah. Put on my big boy pants. Get plus forty defense. Put on your adult penis. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fuck side. Your shoes. Why'd you improve uh... your speed? You were all. Remember why you weren't improving your speed? Now I'm slower than everything else. That's true. Yeah. And right, on top well, of that, you know, if Rick McCrank doesn't have 10 in everything by the end of the game, then he's not Rick McCrank. That's true. Well, Mick, Rick McCrank doesn't need 10 in everything. He could do everything with 1 in everything. So you're so you're telling me that you're giving us an excuse for why there's not going to be 10 in everything at the end of the game. Yes. God damn it. I don't have the money to do so, and I didn't want to get the money. I played this game for 6 hours, <laughs> I didn't want to play it for 7. That's true. What... What the hell All are right. those things? New level, new uh, enemies. These jump around from, you. Yeah. yeah, it's demons from Doom. Yeah. So these guys jump around you and they're annoying to actually hit, but again, they spend that time not constantly trying to wreck you, so it balances out in the end. Uh, Except that. <laughs> that was a really weird fail. No. Kind of like, I don't think why I... Why did it fail you? I don't think uh, I've ever it, gotten over that jump. It's mainly a fail, because that guy keeps getting in the fucking way. Yeah. Well, you'll see, even with the pro, I think I maybe, like, get over that jump once or twice. It's mm. really weird, yeah. for the, given That's the game's physics. Strange. Yeah. Yeah. But, so the new enemies do add some good variety, and we're done with the new weapons. We're not going to get any more. We're back to just chains and baseball bats. Okay. Jamie, so if you haven't seen any of the game... Or since you haven't seen any of the game, we have chains and baseball bats. We just beat people up. Wait, have you seen yeah, any I, of the game? Yeah, I've been watching. Oh. Watching. Yeah. See, this is because he's a good guest. Yeah, yeah. Let's, uh, you know, <coughs> Matt. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. About <coughs> all you other fuckers. <sighs> yeah. 35 items along the way. So is, uh, this, is this level any different in terms of goals, missions? Yeah, you'll see in the second half, this level actually gets quite a few more unique goals, and it becomes a lot more focused on grinding. Like, huh. the levels, I said this in the last video, but they start to become a lot more focused on grinding. And this level is going to be two videos long, because after the boss event, I kept going through events trying to find one that showed off the whole level, but I kept finding different ones that weren't. So I kind of showed off all the unique goals that I ended up stumbling upon. Huh. And then in the next video, we'll get a full level run through. Hmm. Yeah. That's kind of oh. cool. Okay. Which, again, you might think, oh, that's going to suck because this game has shitty grinding physics, but pick a pro with full grind and it'll actually be pretty easy. That's true. Yeah. yeah. That's pretty much a rule of these games. Yeah. You know, this is called Creatures In, right? Yeah. This is not what I was expecting from Creatures In. Yeah. I mean, this seems I was, kind of I was like a bland, a generic... Mountain. Yeah. yeah. Dino Valley would be better. Yeah, I was hoping for... Well, actually, I was hoping for more like... I don't know. Maybe I was being optimistic, but... Hoping for actual dinosaur, scenery. Some actual scenery, maybe? Or, like, dinosaurs? Mm. Well, I mean, maybe later. They'll but... come. Maybe later, yeah. The first half of this level is a bit boring, but once you get into the volcano, it kind of picks up. Oh, well, see, there we go. Oh, yeah, yeah, no. If there's a volcano... I think, we're, yeah. in fact, we're about to drop into it now. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, good. It's just... So we're finally getting some extreme. 
Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. first the first two thirds of the level are admittedly better called Dinosaur Fossil Canyon. Oh really? But then it, gets, it picks up. It's not as it's not as visually good as some of the be earlier levels like Kowloon Connection. I think Kowloon Connection so far has been my favorite. And level. look, we're back to an environmental hazard that just beans you from off screen and you can't avoid them. That's nice. Yeah. They got it right for one level and then they fucked it up again. Yeah. But I mean, it's not really an offensive level. Like, I had more, a lot more problems with Shogun City than this one. I just kind of rolled through this level. Yeah, it seems that this level's really kind of just... Eh. Yeah. Again, yeah. the the events get cool, but the basic events are kind of lame. Oh, there we go. There's some goddamn bones to grind. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. There's some half pipes to go off if the, the physics in this game would let me. No. Instead of just smacking against the side. Oh, man. That is giving me wipeout fusion flashbacks. <laughs> Trying to roll up half pipes and just... Nah... Fucking Temptish Bay, man. Ah. Uh, yeah. Oh, you'll get there when you get there. We'll get there when we... Oh, there. yeah, we'll get there. I think I might go back and watch your... your it's not really old yet, but... No. The, uh, the Wipeout videos again. Uh, <clears throat> oh, yeah, I'm a little far from the mic. Yeah, I might go back and watch your, your Wipeout videos again. Those were pretty good. Those were pretty good videos. I might go back and watch the first time we wrote some Rick McCrank fanfiction. Oh gosh! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What, which game did that come from? Oh, uh, 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 I think it was Hill Bike Boredom. He... No, no, there, no, were, there were after segments. That. There was Toxic Grind when I said write the better plot, and I think that's where Il Muche stood and delivered. Right. Yeah. But Rick McCrank was having a fan base long before that, and he's continuing to have a fan base long after that. Crankers will never die. He's gonna fight another boss. Here we go. Thus far, and no further foolish needs. By controlling the environment as we wish, we ensure a bright future for our race. You foolish oafs cannot understand this need. Those who are subject to control are doomed to extinction, like the dinosaurs of the past. We can even bring the dinosaurs back to life. Those who cannot understand must perish. You will be imprisoned in ice for an eternity of extinction. <laughs> I wasn't listening. All I heard was butt. I just saw some butt. What happened? Uh, apparently, uh, all these changes are beneficial in the long run. Totes. Okay. For them. For creatures. Yeah, yeah for, for them. Um, and because we don't understand, we're meant to die from this red and blue pair of giantesses. Yeah. Red and blue Death from... by Snoo Snoo? Pepsi Man. Pepsi Man. Yeah. We, I'll, I'll, I'll do another Write a Better Plot contest for this game. Or I should, you know. Plot of no. Evo Snow, the earth is going to shit and you gotta stop it. Yeah, what the fuck is with that jump? Yeah, even the, even the creatures weren't making that one. Yeah, no. I actually got kind of lucky in this fight. Like, every time you get frozen, one of those creatures is supposed to come back and absolutely, like, take out half your health bar. But I yeah. think they kept missing. <laughs> that was bad. Could work. So saved by shitty game design. <laughs> or they never bothered coming back. I don't know. Either way, like when I when I'd fight them again, like they wouldn't. They I don't know. They'd be a lot less lean. Huh. But yeah. Also... Imagine Rick McCrank and Boomer and everyone else. They go to the same high school or something. Uh, no, dude. Boomer is their math teacher. He's their math teacher who's always giving them shit. Always giving them, like, a hundred problems. Oh yeah, and they said they summoned a T-Rex, so here it just shows up to eat them. Christ. And Christ on a cock! And McCrank warps into the volcano. Because they assumed you would take longer than, like, a hundred seconds on this. Yeah. Oh, Kelly Clark. Yeah, okay. Kelly Clarkson? Hey. No. No, literally just Kelly Clark. Yeah. How many times is that joke going to be made? Once. Once. So, 
guys, place your place two place your bets. Where are we going next? Are we going to Battlefront or are we going to Battlefront? Oh, um, can we have the chicken instead? No, we're going Battlefront. I want to go to war. Yeah. I find I'm going to wait. Is that? That's the second to last level, oh, Battlefront. Shit. But again, it's two videos from now. So here I go. I'm going to try to find a full uh, length, like a full level mission. And I'm just going to keep finding different things. Okay. Yeah. Kelly Clark. Let's see what she... What, what, were her, what was her best thing? She had best in grinding, even though there's someone who's better at grinding than her. Okay. She had absolutely... No like improvements in defense over the standard max red bar. The game still throws people that are just worse in all regards at you in later levels. Not yeah, really cool, that's actually really weird. Yeah, like Danny yeah. Cass would still be like the second or third best choice for most of these. That's really weird. Cause... I mean. They could have rebalanced everyone so that everyone had a real, like, favorite or real best. But no, they, they've they actually got people who are shittier, which is the exact opposite of what you should be doing with upgrade characters. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you can't really upgrade them, which is yeah, a different problem. Yeah, but the characters themselves are meant to be an upgrade, and right. yet yeah. they're not. Yeah, they're just kind they're of... Fucked up. Uh, so, different or worse. So that first, uh, that first mission, all the crate, all the cubes were on the sign. I mean, on the rails. You had to grind those. And now we're plastering, we're plowing through dinosaur signs. That's really dark. It's really dark. Yeah. It's, it's really, yeah. That's hella dark. I'm sure. Is it? Is it uh, this dark in the game? Uh. Probably not as dark in the game, but... So, dinosaur signs show up, and there's so many signs you can't even, like, see the next one before you crash through it. Jesus. But they're just hanging out like, yo, what's up? You know, uh, the rails part? It's always gonna come back. It, You know what <laughs> game it reminds me of? Yep. Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. Yep. Yeah. There was, uh... There was... Oh, gosh. In the multiplayer, there was a rail map that was, like through a pyramid. I remember that that one was both a really cool level because of the, like, rail design, and also a really shit level because it was really kind of up in the air who was gonna win, mm. because there were no ways to get any specials, and you just kind of grind the rails as fast as the game will let you. Yeah. Although, it does make a difference whether or not you're, like crouched and angling your character correctly to, to work with the rails. But, yeah. But I mean, that's still still kind of lame. Speaking yeah. of rails, yeah. Let's just uh, let's just grind over some giant pits of lava. Whoa! Was that a fucking dragon? Yeah, I don't know. Dragon just shows Are up. Are they just no mixing biggie. up dragons and dinosaurs? They've gotta be. God damn! This is hella extreme. Yeah? I can't even tell which direction is up and down. That is one hell of a grind rail. Yeah. I, yeah. Actually, I don't think we've ever seen a longer grind rail. Yeah. Not in this, this game. Not in this series. That is, I think, the longest rail we've seen. Ever. In, the, in this entire Extreme Sports series. Yeah. Yeah. So props to this game for that, I guess. That was pretty cool. In a, you know, grind rail forever kind of way. And right. naturally doing that would definitely give you gold. And then Kevin Jones shows up. Kevin James. Kev no, it's Kevin Jones. <laughs> <laughs> but if you got to play as Kevin James, that would be really funny. Yeah. I seriously haven't heard of most of these people before. Like, I'm gonna look up Kevin Jones, and it's gonna be like, oh, he placed eighth at the uh, at the Aspen X Games. Yeah, X I've I've heard of Kelly Clark though. Uh, yeah. Yeah, maybe. But I've heard of Kelly Clark from the other games we've done. Rio Tahara. Yeah. I mean, there's. It's like it's weird. All these snowboarding games never really have the list cast list crossover. Like, Terra Dekaitis, the one who I tried to pick in, uh, 
Winter X games, and like all of those people, admittedly I can't remember those people, but I don't think they were any of these guys. Yeah. I The only people I know who cross over a little bit are... I saw Kelly Clark in a couple of the other snowboarding games you've done. Yeah. I think I've seen Danny Cass in a couple. Oh, yeah, and then Sean Palmer, of course. Sean I remember Palmer, all of those yeah. guys. Well, like Tommy Cheshin, Ingmar Backman, uh, yeah. Sean White, 12-year-old Sean White, or, like, young. None of them cross over anyway, so that's half of this level. And we'll pick back up in Part 8 when we'll still be in Creatures in. So we'll probably have Jamie then still. Yep. So I'll see you guys then. Take care.